So this, this was one of our major bird rookeries here, and during the storm a tornado hit it, blew it apart, destroyed it, flipped everything over and washed it away. There's nowhere for the birds to go except for that island, and it's not big enough. So in the evenings you'll see all the birds flying. They like to be together because they warn each other for issues, and then they just fly off. Where they go, who knows. In the evenings the whole island was covered with with birds, and as you can see, there's only one tree left alive, and that's a buttonwood tree right there. That's the only tree that's alive on this island, this whole place. And this is just one of hundreds of islands that have been killed by the storm. If it's not replanted, we're going to lose whatever it is that you find here about that. There's about a thousand things that I love about it. I come out here all the time. I make my living with that little island right there. Now, instead of getting to bring people out here and show them how beautiful it is, I take them over there and I give them a little eco tour on how the mangroves work because I can show them the underneath of the mat and then tell the sad story of, of what happened. It's probably, it'll probably take a day to replant that with mangrove roots. We can do it. Four or five gallon buckets, some mangrove roots, and we can go back to drinking beer and relaxing on our boats. <laughs> Sounds like a good day's work.